Davu. Oh, okay, apparently I'm gonna explain to you. Um, Davu, you're writing a comment. Yeah, I'm writing a comment. This is this is in a legendary reply chain that's finally revived itself. So on Digi's video, how to recognize a great anime in just one episode. The point of this video is to give is to like be sort of a demonstration on how to be more nitpicky and critical when watching stuff. That way you can more quickly identify when you're not gonna like something and then stop wasting your time. But also more quickly identify when you are gonna like something and you can put a priority on seeing it, right? So in this 24 minute video, he sort of breaks down the broad concepts and then he spends most of it breaking down in exhaustive detail the first episode of Steins Gate. Because that's a show that a lot of people say has a weird first episode, but they love the show. Whereas Digi says, I loved it from the first episode, and I'll tell you how. I'll, I'll give you a, I'll give you, I'll open up my own brain and show you how I think those, you know? Then you can save time, like me. And this is part one, right? In part, in part two, he breaks down uh, Lucky Star and Haruhi and I think another one. Um, and in part three, he breaks down how to identify shows you aren't gonna like, right? But part one just focuses on Science Gate. He breaks down the characters, the animation, the like other art style elements, like just like stuff like the coloring, the shading. Uh, he breaks down all the elements of the first episode just to show you how it really indicates how good the whole show really is gonna be. It's like, hey, if this were a shitty show, it wouldn't have a scene like this, right? And people complained that he spent the whole video just talking about Steins Gate. And that baffled me so much that like people complain, uh, you only talked about Steins Gate. Because for one thing, if it makes your point well, then why not? And for the other thing, it's only part one. So there was one comment in particular by, uh, by a guy, by like John Walker II, saying, biggest problem I have with this video. Uh, he makes the time code 308. For starters, let's look at Steins Gate. Nope, the, <clears throat> let me read this in his uh, dialogue, I assume. Nope, the time index. 308 of 2419. And nope, he only talks about Stein's Gate after that. That's 21 minutes of nothing but gushing over Stein's Gate. I'm not pro or against Stein's Gate, but for starters, implies he's going to cover multiple first episodes to prove his case. He doesn't. Oh. The defense fact, I always the come up with is from the fact the that there was one time where I got really episodes, angry defending Ninja Bob first. in a sexual so comment. So it's also worth using him for things that were not true. So it's and not even though even I already disliked Ninja Bob at that point, you need to see the first episode. This pissed me off. I feel so I want to assure you case about the I got super mad at this guy because the stupidity sadly blew my mind. Now, I think I've gotten more cynical in the world since then. More than a month since then. Since then. So it feels more like really a that mad for Steins Gate than anything. But... So, yeah. What I like to do sometimes. Guess he didn't know that it was going to go in. All of a sudden, it's going to like start off and be like, like oh, like, it can't well, just it be a much more severe than the first one, one, right? On a video. It has to be a much more severe This comment about the top. I think that was a mistake in the video. But he's saying that this guy on our series, you know, just. But he's such a bad guy. You got to go back and make excuses. But it's still in the point three while he tried his hard at first. And just even not convincing me. And his way out is now, like, I can't. And I don't think I can get him to stop. I'm going to get a little bit of 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 a little